Hi, Eden. Hey, Danielle. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm all right. How are you? Oh, yeah, good, thank you. I hope this everyone is else is all right as well. Yeah, hey, everyone else. Hopefully, hope everything worked and we're tuning in all right. <laughs> yeah, I hope he can <laughs> see us both. Otherwise, it's just like a video chat between us and that's it. Yeah, otherwise, we're just like FaceTiming. <laughs> yeah. Which, to be fair, we haven't done that much of actually in this quarantine time. No, we haven't spoke that much. We have haven't we? spoke. Well, not like on camera face to face, like this. Really? No. Oh, we have, we've spoke over text and we've been playing that game, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're playing um, like Pictionary, isn't it? What's it called? Um, draw something. Draw something. Yeah. That's a good, good game. We've been drawn to each other. Yeah, man, it's good. <laughs> Keep to the views. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's good, though. I mean, really, we see we draw to each other and everything, but like, we literally live like over there. Yeah, no, you're in, like, would be in front of me right now. We could post it through the whatever. Yeah, no, we could literally have, like, you know those things with the cannon and the wire? Yeah, dude. Yeah. We um, through it. <laughs> We're the string. We could have it through the windows, yeah. We should definitely do that, dude. Yeah, We've no. Got the time. We've got the time. We may as well do we it. We do. We do. Yeah, We'd man. have to make a long wire, though. Yeah, we can find wire. Or string or oh, whatever. Yeah. Oh, yeah, string. String, that's it. Yeah, but I mean, you know, it's good to see you know, still dyeing your hair and it and everything and doing your nails. I haven't dyed my hair yet. I wonder if anyone else is doing like personal beauty at home. Yeah, that's why I'm wearing a hat. Like, my hair is just, it's a mess, man. It's sugary. That needs cutting. Look at that. I might do more heating. That's why I'm wearing the hat. I wear it all the time. Yeah, no, my eyebrows need waxing, but since not being at work, I'm no. just like, I haven't I haven't tried to do it. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to come out with the couch looking like Tom Hanks and pass away like long hair, big beard, <laughs> eyebrows like joining into my beard. I don't know. <laughs> I'm a little crazy, dude. I feel like I'll try more at the end of it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, like I'm, I'm saving my my nice shampoo and that, so I'll come out. So I'll come out. Yeah. Back. I'm saving all my tan for when I come out. Mm. Mm. Yeah, but it's it's it's, it's going to be like living in a bunker. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if you go to the shops, like still like, on edge and that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> if you see anyone with a mask, you're off. <laughs> it's going to be crazy, man. But I'm, I know. I mean, you know, it's all good, man. Well, it's all good. I know. It's what we do, isn't it? Like, what have you been doing? In you know, what I mean, keeping yourself busy in that. Well, we've been like, we've been cooking, like, you know, like a parmesan that you won't cook at home. Mm. We've been trying to like cook stuff you won't cook at home, so like pizzas, parmesans, um, surfing turf. That is a good one. Jesus, you've been eating serpent. <laughs> oh my oh, god! Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm looking the cooler. Like, what kind of cow is this? There's, there's a there's a, a meat pie that fried like six months ago. We'll give that a go. You had a pizza, <laughs> didn't you? You what was that? You had a pizza, didn't you? Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. no, it was awesome. Was yours barbecue chicken then with sweet corn? Yeah, no sweet corn. Um, oh, I made, that's what I, was I made the the, uh, the dough roll out and everything. And I like barbecue sauce, there. and I cheese it, and then I chicken it, and then I oven it, and then I did more barbecue sauce, more cheese. <laughs> more oh, more cheese, is, cheese is the way to go on a pizza. What was that, dude? Cheese is the way to go on a pizza. Oh, cheese is the way to go to everything. You can melt yeah. cheese on anything. On your yeah, I know. Like, if you're like, oh, you know what? This cereal is all right. I love the cheese on it. It's amazing. That would be, it'd be a bit weird, but like, I'd, yeah. I'd, have, I'd have it. Dude, it'd work. Dude. It'd yeah, work. I know. Um, 
But yeah, it's uh, I can't see. Yeah, man. But yeah, I don't know. I've been trying to keep myself busy. I'm not very good at like, DIY stuff. <laughs> I uh, yeah, I'm not that good at that. So I um, I've been I've been trying to fix things, but I think I'm making things worse. Yeah, I've been doing like bits and pieces. Like trying yeah. to paint and stuff, but it's finding stuff to do, isn't it? Oh yeah. No, I'm just like I keep putting screwdrivers and stuff and I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm learning. Yeah, me too actually. I'm broken in two. Yeah, I've oh. been doing like exercises twice a day and stuff. Oh, you've been exercising. You know what I have actually? I've been doing like I've been trying to do like um like 45 minutes an hour a day. I'm just doing like, you know, some core stuff, some weights, keeping rope, I'm doing all sorts of stuff. I must admit, I haven't been doing 45 minutes to an hour. Really? I've been doing more like two, eight minutes a day, like on a morning, on a night, and that's if I'm lucky. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do it on the morning, definitely, but then. If I'm tired on a night, then it's just like, yeah. Yeah, but it's better than nothing, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, well, I'm doing more than I usually would. Yeah. Hang on. It's probably Have dear. you got technical ease? A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> Which is better. <laughs> yeah, man. And I've, you know, like, I've, play guitar sometimes and that and I like to jam on that like I've been just tuning them and like just getting everything I'm just trying to get everything like mint in the house you know I yeah. was I'm trying to I fix. bet a lot of people I bet a lot of people in their houses as well I bet they're trying to do like stuff that they they won't usually do yeah yeah but they'll probably be better bet completely different. yeah Jesus. I know, like, I went on, um, like, my brother's Facebook and stuff, and he, his decking's all done and looking like, really good and that. And I'm just I've seen that, actually. <laughs> I'm just trying to, like, just all sounds funny. That's what I do. Glue things and drill things. And I don't know. I'll get there. Are you going to deck out the back? <laughs> yeah, dude. I'm gonna go pool. Keep up with it. <laughs> I'm gonna have fish in my pool. My have you been doing any massages at home then? Yeah, I haven't stopped. I've been I... doing more than I do at work. I'm missing my massages, I've got to say. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, I've got aches and pains everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I mean, you know, you know. I pop back, stretch a lot. Yeah, yeah. You do what you can, innit? Yeah, I bet yeah. a lot of people are missing out on stuff like that. People used to. Yeah, I know. Even just like getting your hair done. Like for me, going the trip to the barber is like the whole thing. You know what I mean? Like I'd make an afternoon of it. Like it was chilled out, it was cool to relax in and all I do now is, you know, I I just depend. <laughs> put like a hot towel on my face and just sit honestly I've been putting them because uh, I'm always so conscious about my bags with my eyes oh yeah I've been bad. putting tea bags have you I've been putting tea bags but like cold like a cool compact tea bag yeah and I've just been laying up with my face like that they look better I can't, I can't see them <laughs> like, yeah it, it, it's weird in this light. You definitely can't tell the difference. But, um, because usually they're like really, really bad. Do you know um, what? They do look better, I think. I, I think they do. I think they do. I've only been doing it for like less than a week. I've been doing about a week. Honestly, the thing is, the best thing about it is it's chill, like it's relaxing. I feel like yeah. I'm having something done. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, like, sit there, like, um... chill out. <laughs> Nice. So yeah, man, I'm uh, looking after myself. Yeah, no, I've been trying like different skin things. I'm trying out as well as for people and for me. 
See mm. what I can do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, man, it's wild out there, but wait, I'm I'm good in here, man. Chill out in the garden. Yeah, no, we'll probably miss it when we out. Yeah, I'm missing her take business. <laughs> Like, you know, a little bit of salt and pepper chicken. Oh, man. I tell you what, we did a salt and pepper chicken at home and it was really nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome, man. Yeah, but that's the thing, you're a good cook. Like, I can boil pasta. That's about it. <laughs> no, that's the same as me, but Wendy can cook very well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, She's good. I remember, I remember her. She's good. That's the thing, man. It won't be long. It won't be long. Then we're all back out and everything's normal. And that. Everything will be normal soon, yeah, and it'll be like it never happened. Yeah, yeah, no. It's, uh... it's all good, man. It's all well, good. do you want to start on some questions? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah? Have uh -oh. we got any of anyone's live coming? Uh... Yeah, we've got we've got a few people live right now. If you want to ask questions, go right ahead. We've got some that um, people have sent in from before. Yeah. So there is that. So we've got some of them um, while people, you know, write in and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So pop a comment down if you've got anything to ask us about anything. Yeah, yeah. It, doesn't matter if it, it could be personal, it could be business related, whatever. You know? Yeah, it doesn't matter, whatever, yeah. Probably while we're here. We've got a mix um, of everything, these ones, haven't we? Yeah, man. Yeah, it's good. No, we've had some good questions, for sure. Uh, well, I'll go first asking you. All right, then I'll go. Then I'll ask you. Cool. Um, okay, cool. Right, so this is asked by Helen. Okay. It's what dermological range is best for sensitive skin? All right, okay. So I would go for ultra calming. Um, you can either get like the separate products or you can get the kits. So if you're moving to dermalogica is like your new skin routine, then I the kits have all the basics in them. Um, but if you are just looking for a separate product, then do that as well. Um, it's completely up to you, but I do love Dermalogica. Um, as well as that, we do have a code now. And when you pop this code in, once you're buying your product on the Dermalogica website, you can get, it's a free travel sized um, product, free with your purchase. So I'll get Nicole to pop the comment below. But yeah, thank you, Helen, for that question. Yeah, that's close. Dermalogica right. is class. It is, yeah. We've been yeah. using it forever. Yeah, yeah. So, I'll ask you yours. So, this <laughs> was asked by Phil. And he says, I have a knot in my shoulder and it's causing me pain. While I can't get to you, how can I ease the pain? Uh, okay, Phil. Thanks for asking. Um, I mean, if you're isolating with anyone... Be good if you you know got them to do at least a few minutes just kind of manipulating the area you know just a little bit just to get some relief um but yeah another thing as well never underestimate a hot bath heat yeah, I agree. so much the time muscle knots all that um definitely stretch as well keep kinetic so you know Little circles, big circles. I did a video on Facebook, um, the stretch to distress stuff. So anything like that, and um, you can you can you see some huge differences. And that's what I did. I um, not so much not so much shoulder, but in my lower back, it's just stretching it out, stretching everything out, and you know, keeping it. It's it's good to rest, but when I say rest. Just don't overdo things, but we'll still keep moving, you know. I think that's, that's important too. Um, but yeah, I mean, if, if it's you know the general aches, 
you've got when you wake up tonight, your shoulder hurts or or your lower back hurts or whatever. Um, yeah, hate just for that. But if it's yeah. if it's injury, if you know like you've hurt it, like you know I've got my shoulder because I've been doing things bad or whatever like me. Um, if you're doing something like that, then probably the best way to go is to go the other way, so cool. So, you know, ice, frozen peas, ice bath, they're not the most comfortable, but if you've got an injury, an ice bath is just awesome DIY stuff you can do. So, make a choice, go with either, or you know what, go with the ball, and you will definitely feel Yeah, do like a mix and match. Yeah, yeah. awesome. Awesome for it. Yeah, no, there's nothing worse than a pain, is there? No, it sucks. Especially at this time because you feel like you can't do anything about it. Yeah. You're at home. Like, you know, what else can I do? But there is stuff you can do at home for sure. And yeah. so basically stretch, keep kinetic, bath, hot or cold. That's what I'd say. Good well, luck, Phil. <laughs> yeah, good luck, Phil. <laughs> keep it up, man. Uh, cool. I'll... Um, I'll do another one for Danielle. Uh, what energizes you about your career? Asked by Millie. Very nice. Good question, Millie. Um, so, what energizes me? I like when I get someone in, so say it's a facial, and they have a skin concern, and I get to fix it. So, I love helping people. I love when they come in. They want to get the nails done, they want to get their eyebrows tinted, and they're just, you know, they're having a down day, and it makes them feel completely better. I just, I love the feeling of making someone feel better. If it's not, obviously, you're a nurse, but in a way that they just feel uplifted, and it just makes them so much more concentrated on the life, just that's what makes me happy. Yeah, no, that's 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 the one. And you know what? Same for me as well, really. I yeah. love it. I love a good result. I think it's awesome. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Makes you, like, make you feel better. Yeah. 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 So when we help you, we give you help if, if you like helping you. <laughs> yeah, you get yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. So this one is asked by Susie. Um. What is your favourite massage treatment to do? I mean, obviously, I like them all. I like all of them. That's a hard one. Yeah, yeah. I mean, my favourite is probably the Bix massage. Um, just because it's kind of like a, it's obviously it's a combination of the different pressures, you know. So we kind of go level up. So it's not a small and yeah. Get and you get a bit of hot stone with it as well. So I think the um, mixing the pressure with the heat is awesome for getting out not some tight muscle and, and all that stuff. And, and, and that's what I feel like I get really good results. But I mean, everyone's different, you know. Like some people do better from having the full uh, session of just hardcore pressure, just relentless pressure. You know, I, I like a good result. I'm, I'm going to say yeah. generally. I feel like I'll get the better result with the fix. Yeah, that's a good one. A mm. bit I've of done, everything. I've done the fixed massage for you. Right, do the little the, the things of pressure in the hot zone. So. I like a mixture. Because if you're feeling like because I see I want a bit of everything. Mm. So when like when my back hurts, I know I want heat. But then I like someone to go soft, but then I like it hard at the same time, so I know it's going to fix it. So I like a bit of everything. Yeah, it's like a buffet, but of massage. You know? Yeah. A little bit. A little bit of <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah, man. Cool. Uh, the next one. <clears throat> I have quite a lot of questions. It's good. I know, yeah, it's good. I dig it. Um, what is the difference between dry skin and dehydrated skin? And oh, Pam, okay. I one. Shout out to Pam. Okay, right. So, Pam, dry skin is when you're lacking oil in the skin. 
or lipids. Um, dehydrated skin is lacking water. So whether it is dry or dehydrated skin, um, dry is a skin type and dehydration is a skin condition. So for the dry, you're going to need oil. For the dehydration, you're going to need water. So look for the products for the dry one that you're going to get a lot of oil, a lot of moisture back into your skin, whether you're having a facial, whether it is products. Um, dehydrated, you're going to want a lot of water, a lot of hydration. So just keep your eye for those different things. So remember, oil and water, like two separate things. So you want to look for those different things. I'm sure my yeah. skin has always been like dry, I'd say. I'm always flaking. But as long as you've got a good moisturiser um, to keep it going, then you're all right. I'll move this tree out the way because it's attacking me. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one, dude. You know you're stuck, man. Wow. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. You <laughs> yeah. Ah, cool, cool, cool. Cool. I, uh, okay, so uh, me next. Yeah, I'm going, I'm going. <laughs> right. So this was asked by Samantha. Uh -huh. I would like to start meditation, but I don't know what it is. Okay. Um, well, meditation is it's definitely nothing to be kind of scared of or intimidated of or, or whatever. Because, I mean, you have an idea of it, like, like a lot of people do, especially when you haven't experienced it. Where you just kind of, you know, people are sat and they're cross legged and they're, you know, doing crazy positions and you're like, I don't, I don't feel like I'm up. I mean, the core of meditation isn't really about that. It's, um, I mean, that its base form is just focused breathing, you know? It's just focusing yeah. on your breathing and your breath and if any kind of outside thoughts or anything enters your mind, just. Let the thought pass, return you can see your breathing. And you do meditation. You know, that's it. I mean, there's a different type of meditation, you know. Some people meditate when they're on a dog. You know, some people uh, do transcendental meditation. You know, where it's yeah. just kind of that little bit more hardcore visualization. You get body scans. You can do a lot of things with meditation. The thing is, find what works for you. And as long as you're breathing, and you're focusing on your breath, you're doing meditation. Yeah. So have a look, see what works for you. you know? But um, I know for for me, just breathing alone is awesome. Just just purely do that. Get comfy. Breathe. You feel all your stresses go, you feel you know, a little more relief. You feel your body, your mind, everything. So find out what, what That was a really good question. Awesome question. Awesome I think question. a lot of people wondered that as well, don't they? So it was really good. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, cool. The next one for Danielle. Yeah. Is Who's the most organised in the team? Asked by Sam. Good question, Sam. <laughs> right. Yeah, I think you so, want. <laughs> if you I haven't already guessed anyone else, <laughs> um, it's going to be Nicole. <laughs> yeah. Nicole has everything. She's very organised. Yeah. She's very planned. Uh, the rest of us aren't. <laughs> We're like headless chickens running around. Yeah, no, she's uh, good. She is. She she gets everyone grouped together. She makes you feel like safe, and she tells you like like you need to do this or you need to do that, and then you just feel so much better that Nicole's like took it. <laughs> do you know what I mean, Aiden? Yeah, N Nicole is probably the most used word in the salon because every time anyone's got a question, Nicole. Yeah. Nicole. Nicole. It's usually me. Oh, <laughs> Even if you're in a panic, you're running around like, where's oh, the yeah. wall? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, she's like the, yeah. uh, she's like the coach to your football team. Yeah. yeah she's the, she, she might as well have a whistle like, right, you in that room, you in that room, you're there. Yeah. Check the conductor. But if we didn't have that, 
if we didn't have that, we'd be lost. Oh, dude. Dude, <laughs> I'd, I'd be a mess in the corner. Yeah, I'd be yeah, be, be right. <laughs> yeah uh, good question. That was a good question. Nicole. Yeah, yeah. Right. I'll ask yours now. So this was asked by Mary. What is a funny story that has happened to you and the rest of the team? Oh man. There's so many. <laughs> what? There's a lot to choose from, for sure. Um, yeah. You know what, probably actually the more recent one. Um, so me, uh, I, had a, I had a guy in and I mean, obviously we can't, you know, see no names or anything, but let's just say he was called Guy. All right. And uh, I had a guy in and, you know, so I came to him and I, oh, hi, Guy, you want to follow me? I'll take you through. And we went through to the room, you know, we did the consultation, I was asking him what he wants, what he didn't want, you know, what he was, he was thinking, he was like, yeah, I mean, my, you know, my, my foot hurts sometimes, you know, and I'm like, oh, okay, we, we can do that, I can work on your foot, you know, I can do some, some pressure stuff, so if you just want to, like, I'll, you know, I'll do a bit on your calf and stuff as well, like, you might as well have my whole leg done, you know. So stemming from yeah. there, really. So I was like, just take off uh, your jeans, lay on the bed, put your things to the side there, and I was doing just a minute. And he was like, You want me to take off my jeans? <laughs> I, mean, I, only, I only want to. I was like, What? I was like, Nicole had someone in. <laughs> I didn't see him name. Who's wanting to get his oil cut? <laughs> so you took the wrong person. I took the wrong guy. <laughs> <laughs> I basically asked him to take his clothes off in the room. So <laughs> he was, <laughs> was, was terrified then. Dude, I was like, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, I was like, guy? He was like, yeah. I was like, do you want to me? The oh, thing is, like, oh. it's so easy to happen, isn't it? Like, Oh, you can't dude. understand how easy that is when you have the same name. Like at school, when someone has the same name, like you make a big deal out of it, don't you? It never happens. Yeah. It happens a lot. Yeah, it does happen a lot. With the last name yeah. as well. Like, yeah, I dude. <laughs> it's crazy, man. It's crazy, but it does happen. Yeah. But it's definitely, uh, yeah, my bad there. Sorry, guy. If you're watching, you watch <laughs> Man, Jesus. Yeah, that was a funny story. That was, that was a funny story. Good day. We've got um, plenty. <laughs> yeah, we do. Uh, cool, cool. Um, this one is asked by Rebecca. Yeah. What are the benefits of microdermabrasion? Okay. So I don't know whether you've had microdermabrasion before. Um, a lot of to a lot of people it sounds scary, but it's honestly not. It's like a tiny little sander, just a little drill bit. I'm making it sound scary, but it just literally just goes around your face nice and softly and just takes the dead layers off the skin. So the benefits are it helps with acne, it helps with acne scarring, um, it helps reduce fine lines and wrinkles. So if aging's something that you know bugging you then it's a good one to go for. Or if acne, you know, getting you down, another good one to go for. Um, it helps reduce age spots, um, helps with some damage. And my favourite one of all is that it brightens your skin and gives you a glow. So if you love that natural glow, are you always putting highlighter on your skin? This one is the one to go for microdermabrasion because it gives you, like, even underneath your makeup, you can just see that glow and it's a proper nice natural glow like it doesn't look fake it doesn't look it just looks so like powerful almost and everyone that comes to me that is the thing they want the most out of it mm. even though it has all its benefits <laughs> that one is the one people stick to but it's really popular yes yeah, nice but i've had it i've had it, well, yeah, you I, have I, it. I haven't had it in a while i've got these lines up here go my forehead 
And honestly, one session, then when lines just kind of meld together, it feels so much smoother. It's awesome. It's, it's really clever. Like, I've been even naughty, and I've even took the microdome abrasion machine home, and I did one on myself. Because, <laughs> of course, you have to. Yeah, man. It's self-care, isn't it? Yeah. Not selfish, it's self-care. Yeah, I'm like testing it. it out for the clients. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, right. I'm, next. I'm next. Yeah. So, this is asked by Leanne. How did you and Nicole meet? That's a nice one. <laughs> All right, yeah. I was expecting like a... Yeah, okay. Um... Oh, I'm going to mention I was there. <laughs> yeah, you were there. I was always there. You were in <laughs> hot. Yeah. The first but time yeah. I got in the house. Yeah. You would have been in a cot. Um, yeah, me and Nicole met when we were six. We moved into the same street at the same time. And we just, you know, same age. We just hung out a little bit. We had other friends. That we seen, you know, friends of friends and we see each other there as well. And then... When secondary school hit, we went to the same school. We were friends all through school. We walked to school together. We'd go home from school together. We'd school together. You know, we were just always hanging out. You know, we were always friends. And then when I was 16, so we were about to leave school. One for five months for me. I asked her out, you know. And I was stood there. <laughs> you, you were there the whole time. <laughs> you were, um, like we were just friends with all three of us all the yeah, time. Like, even before we were going out, we were both there. Like, oh, you would go up there for fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're always doing something. And then when me and the course started going out, we were just doing things more. Yeah. yeah that, that was the only thing that happened. We just did things more often, like every day or two, we'd just walk out. And, do anything and you know, now me and Nicole are married, we all work together. It's it, man, it's crazy. Oh. <laughs> and I've always been in the middle. Oh, yeah, dude. I'll never end it. Sit in the middle. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's good, man. You know, thing, we yeah. like each other, so it wasn't in the middle, like, it was all good. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's fun, man. All good fun. No, good question as well. I have a question. God, so, so we've known each other for like nearly 20 years. Yeah. That's crazy, man. I know. That's bad, right? I'm going gonna, right, gonna to go to the next one. I can talk yeah. about that. <laughs> um, so this is asked by James. Okay. Name a funny thing that's happened once whilst working. Okay, very good question, James. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff that's happened that we've laughed about and that's been crazy. Um, ooh, one that's springing to mind is something that happened to me. Um, so we had some nails coming in, and before the nails came in, I was in the rooms putting some peppermint oil down. Now, I'm not sure whether any of you have ever had a little peppermint oil bottle before and the peppermint runs onto the sides of the glass and so Aiden knows this <laughs> so I was spreading the oil round and after I was done I was just about to wash my hands and I felt something in my eye I rubbed my eyes and like two seconds later all of a sudden there was a pain shooting through my eyes I was running round, thought I was blind, and the tears <laughs> were streaming. Then I knew I had to go in and do these nails. So I went into the nails and there was honestly like, all tears down my eyes. And I was even sniffling. And by the end of that day, I was so grateful to go home. <laughs> like, I do not, Aiden, you've had peppermint in your eyes, haven't you? Oh, dude. It's, it's wild. It's easy if you get it, like, on your finger and you just sniff the peppermint oil it's in your eye no so it's actually crazy. It in your yeah. eye. 
It's bad. Well, it's, it's like bad. the pepper spray. Peppermint. You know, the... Yeah, yeah, pepper spray. That's good. Yeah. Oh, man. It's rough, dude. It is. It's bad. But yeah. I remember Nicole could not stop laughing at me. Oh, because I, honestly... I love that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> when it happens to someone else, it's hilarious. Yeah. But when it happens to you, it's like move. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, things what you can do, like just wash it off. But if you go into a treatment, oh. you have a treatment. Yeah, you just have to oh, hold what? that out and just like oh, your yeah. eyes are wide open and you're just like, oh. I'll do it. Yeah. Are using your sleep? Yeah. <laughs> oh man, yeah, it's rough. <laughs> And that's things we we work with oils a lot. Yeah, we're always with them. There's always some oil somewhere. And you get it too close to your nose, or your, even your mouth. Like you feel oh, like it stings it everything. Yeah. yeah. It, and it goes cold. Yeah. Which is weird, but yeah, yeah no, that, that stings. <laughs> Don't put peppermint um, oil anywhere near you. <laughs> speaking of oil, we have got. The message here, yeah, from Beverly. Is yeah, it, Aiden, can you use any oil to massage with? I mean, you can do. I probably wouldn't recommend like motor oil. To oh, massage. peppermint oil! Don't use peppermint oil. <laughs> <laughs> do a favor. Yeah, don't do that. Um, but, you know, like, speaking of things that are around the house, like, yeah, you could use vegetable oil, you could use yeah. olive oil, you could use olive oil, you could use olive oil, you know? A lot of massive oil comes from, like, grapes oil and stuff, so... Yeah. By all means, you can use any, any oil to massage with. Um, but, of course, you know, depends what you massage. It's harder to massage your feet with oil, so if you ever want to, like, massage your feet or massage your feet, or um, yeah, it's better. Um, yeah, you know, back, calf, hands, not anything like that. Uh, yeah, vegetable oil, olive oil, yeah, flour oil, all that stuff, fine to use. Yeah. So, uh, you know, fine, man, it's good, it's good to hear. Um, cool. So you got a question for me, Danielle, right? Yeah, yeah. Right. So this one is asked by Georgia. What's your favourite thing about your job? Oh, damn. My favourite thing about the job. Um, I, you know what I love to do? I love meeting people. Like, I love talking to people. I like getting to know, you know, what's going on. But I always like to have a little chat for my like, anyway, you know. I love it. And I have to stop myself from hanging in the massage sometimes. I just love it so much. <laughs> so, like, I love, like, you know, people. And, and that's what's so awesome about this job is I get to meet so many people. Yeah. Yeah, and you do see a lot through the doors. There's a lot of people come through the doors. And, you know, we we don't get more one than another. We get males, females, all ages. You know, like, we get a few people come through the doors. So it's, it's good and it's perfect for me. So, Even... The like stories that. to tell. Oh, dude. The you tell some good stories. Crazy stuff. Awesome stuff. I love it. I love it, man. Yeah, so I love just working with people. Yeah. And, I, and I like, I like you know, like before, I like the good result. So yeah. anything I do that I can get a good result, I, I'll do. You know, I love it. But uh, yeah, please, you know, if you keep talking, you keep coming into us. Keep talking, please. I like it. <laughs> he loves it. <laughs> um, oh, I've got... Hang on. One second, dude. I've got one last one for you. Um, yeah, I've got one last one for you after this. Is it? Oh, sweet. Um, what is your favourite treatment to do? And Rachel asked that one. Thanks, Rachel. Okay. My favourite treatment would be facials. So, like I said earlier, when they come in with a skin concern and I get to fix it, it's like, it just, I love seeing them walk out the door and they're happy. 
and they can come back to me and I can see how they're doing and they can message me. And I just, yeah, so facials, I love learning about the skin uh, and I love fixing problems. So facials is definitely my favourite treatment to do. Yeah. And Aidan, I think yours is helping people too, like you said, isn't it? So yeah, I think everyone's on the same line. Yeah, that's good to hear. Good to hear we're on the same page at least, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, you could be on complete opposite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's good. Yeah, um, and you're good at it as well. You're good at facials. Thank you. Yeah, and you're good at waxing as well. Sort my eyebrows out. Oh yeah, sort your eyebrows out. Yeah, man. Apart from that one time, I tinted them and made them really big for you. Dude. <laughs> I mean, that you know, fun, my hair is quite dark anyway. That tint on, man. <laughs> that was accidentally on purpose. Yeah, I bet it was. <laughs> right. <laughs> so the last question is yeah. asked by Lisa. Uh huh. Did you start working immediately after school? No. No, I didn't. I um, you know, I had some little stuff like I did better wear for a while. Which I, was I remember that. Terrible at. Terrible. Well, I didn't have a car. So I had to get on my skateboard and skate to houses with mops on my shoulder to deliver them. And that was that was oh that was hard, man. That was hard. And I and I did hold on post for a while. Same thing really. But um through school I I went to college and I did uh, film and television production. Um, which was awesome, good fun. And you know what, as well? I was at school, I was quite quiet. You know, like, I didn't really push the button much. I just kind of put my own to my own. You know, I didn't want to, like, rock the boat. I didn't talk at all. And, you know, I wasn't that confident. But going through college really... Kind of help my confidence grow because I was kind of meeting people a little more like me, and you had to do something. You did stuff on camera, off camera. You were meeting people. It was a lot of a lot of running around and talking and stuff, and just, like had to build your confidence to do. Um, so that, that that to me taught me so much. And I mean, I've done stuff at work as well, like a little videos, you know, the um, the man advert. Look, we had going on the with men and <laughs> no, I did little little like that. I do for work, so. it's good fun. I like doing what I do. I like doing what I did. I like doing what I do now. I think they're a good match. And then straight from college, I joined what time your feet company. Yeah, that's here, and then it's been here since. You know, I love it. I love it, man. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> they were all really good questions. They were, well. yeah, dude. Really in detail. <laughs> oh, dude. We've been live for 43 minutes. Oh, my God. Yeah, we have. <laughs> it's felt like 10 minutes. Dude, I could do this for hours, man. Yeah, I could. Good. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, it's... Uh... No, it's good. we've nailed this, man. Yeah, we've nailed this. I hope people have enjoyed watching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. You know, everyone watching at home, chilled out. You know what? You can do anything right now. Be watching us. I want to say thank you. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Oh, sweet man. Well, we'll definitely do this again soon. I like it. Yeah, I like it. Get to talk. I like answering all the questions as well. So, and then I, I, next time I want like a, like a studio like yours. You got your yeah, club, dude. You got, I, you know. Apart from this one started attacking me at one point. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking like that. So maybe just be careful on which ones you get. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll find something, man. But yeah. Next time I'll have a, I'll have a studio like you. Yeah. You need to be cool like me. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, and the mic. My head. I don't know. I do something. Let <laughs> me shave this thing. Yeah. It's getting long. 
See, you need to work on yourself, man. Self care, innit? Yeah. For sure. Yeah. So, um, well, uh, thanks to everyone for tuning in. Yeah, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Um, we hope you're staying at home. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, stay home. Stay home. You know, if, you, if you're outside watching this, go home. Quick. You know. <laughs> yeah, stay in your house. Yeah, please. It, please. It'll be over soon. Yeah, for sure, man. Won't be long. And then it'll all be better. But everyone needs to stay inside and stay safe. Temporary, innit? Yeah. Pin is temporary, glorious forever. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good yeah. one. <laughs> I, think a lot. I think, like, yeah. you know, some, like, I don't know. My apologies. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, man. Stay inside, stay safe, stay tuned into the Panther Lounge. We'll do more stuff like this. Yeah. Uh, sooner better than later. I'm going to do it. Good, man. Yeah. Good. Uh, I hope well, we get a lot more questions as well. Yeah, yeah. Keep your questions coming in. You know? Yeah, keep them coming. If you want to post it publicly, you know, private message with some uh, questions, we'll answer them in the next yeah, one. Okay. Hopefully soon. And uh, yeah, man. Peace out, Daniel. See you next yeah, time. Bye, Ayrton. Bye, everyone. Uh, bye, everyone else. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> bye.